Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be teaching you how to defeat the bosses in Chapter 4, Season 2 of Fortnite. Many people don't really know what the bosses are, but whenever I say boss, you might recognize that I mean the guy with two henchmen. He wears a black suit and he has two henchmen wearing white suits. He has not as much health as the other bosses do from last season, but he does have around 400 to 300. I will teach you everything that you need to do to be able to kill him, the weapons you need, and all the other stuff you need. So this boss is kind of weird. It doesn't have a specific spot that it stays at. It goes to a random named location in the match, but I'm not completely sure about this, but I think it has a higher chance of landing at Mega City because I have seen it land more at Mega City than I have seen it land anywhere else. Let's land and see if we can find him anywhere. Well, not find. Let's say more locate. I know they sound similar, but whenever the boss spawns, it'll tell everyone where it is on the map. So you could just find it. So this first part would just be me collecting as much loot as I could, but there are specific things just like the most wanted in the last season there are specific things that you need to get so I'll tell you those whenever I get them so we're back to talking about shotguns shotguns they aren't the best for fighting the boss because like I said you don't want to get close range but this boss is weapon isn't as strong as the most hinted, most ugh, most wanted weapon in season one. So we are at a pretty good advantage with the shotgun, but I wouldn't say it's the best advantage. You need more of snipers, say. The Cobra DMR, the Dragon's Breath Sniper, and all the other snipers that you can find in this new season are the best for killing this guy. I'll show you why whenever we get to him. Did you hear that? That is the noise your game makes whenever the boss is spawned. Everyone gets this mark on their screen. I'm gonna run to it as fast as I can because this is a tutorial on how to kill the boss because, you know, I need money. Yo! <laughs> and now healing. The heals that you need are very specific. The slap juice, the chug splash, are the best that you can get but the chug cannon is the worst not because it doesn't give you much shield because it takes up a lot of room it takes up two slots of room in your inventory and you need all the slots you can for whenever we kill the boss so maybe we should get some chug splash or something because chug splash is not as rare as slurp juice And now we're here. They won't attack you unless you attack them first. So I would recommend building above them and some sort of wall, add windows. But I make a crucial mistake here. I made him out of wood. Start headshot sniping him as much as possible until they notice you. He is one snipe away from dying, but now his henchmen are gonna destroy the walls. So you need to be prepared. You need to be ready to build walls over and over and over again, and then just run as much as you can. Building is the most important thing, besides healing, the most important thing in killing this boss.
killing his henchmen first is probably the best thing you can do. You want to get the boss low and then kill his henchmen. Because his henchmen will always be after you. Always, always, always. And if you kill them first while the boss is low, you can get rid of the boss extremely easily without having a million little guys come at you. Now all you gotta do is put the key card in and wait for the vault to open. And there you have it. Thank you for watching this video so much. Uh, I'm hopefully it helped you defeat these bosses. I'm afraid I think they might go away soon. I'm not sure though. This video, if it helps, leave a like. Comment shout out if you want a shout out, and subscribing would help me a lot. I love each and one of my subscribers and each and one of my viewers, so subscribing would help out a lot. Any other things that you want me to post, any other games you want me to play, I'll play them. Uh, thanks for watching, have a nice day, and yeah!